Hey everybody, it's Mark from uh, EastCapeSkiffs.com. Uh, we've got another 2010 loss from leaving the shop today. It's a beautiful skiff. Um, this is a repeat customer. Had a Gladesman and wanted to uh, upgrade to, uh, to something a little bit bigger, Lossman. We'll start with the, the front of the skiff. Uh, casting platform, uh, the standard one, beautiful. It's got the, the sissy bar tubes in there so he can put a back uh, backrest in there so when he's in the, in the rough stuff, he can have something to hold on to. It's got a little pop-up cleat we installed up here for him so he can tie off. And nice uh, new Minn Kota trolling motor, Riptide. Um, you want it this hard mounted. Uh, but with a plug, a release plug. Flyline tow rails. Guy's a fly fisherman. A flush push pull clip here so that uh, when he's out there pulling and his angler's up front, he can drop that down and it's not a tow stubber. Another neat uh, little option. The standard Lossman Center console uh, with a grab bar here. Uh, so he's walking around in the rough stuff. He's got something to hold on to or his anglers, passengers. Uh, nice Garmin uh, we installed. Simple but effective. Standard gauges for the Yamaha 70 in the back. Standard seat cushions, of course, flip up, flip down, uh, give you nice comfort, and also flip down to give you the ability to get in these hatches. Back here. Uh, new platform. Uh, I wouldn't say new, but uh, newer to the Lostmans. This is something that we put on the, uh, the Vantage and, and recently on a Cayman, uh, but it's uh, the shape swinging backwards, a little more aerodynamic, if you will. Uh, looks fast for sure. Uh, it's got the sissy bars in there, so that lean bar from the front can be transferred to the back. Uh, so he's up there pulling and needs some extra stability. He can. Uh, he can put it in there and get it. Uh, you can see it's got a jack plate on there because this is a tunnel boat. Atlas jack plate um, installed to get that 70 because this is an HP package Lossman, by the way, with an upgraded horsepower, 70 horsepower. Um, but uh, the jack plate gets that uh, prop up there into the tunnel and gets him real skinny when he's under power. Nice standard six foot power pull. Uh, stake himself out uh, when he gets on those fish so he doesn't drift up on that school. He can poke that thing down in the ground and. Uh, have uh, multiple shots. Just come around the other side of the skiff here. You can see uh, we installed a 12 volt plug for him. Uh, put his cell phone, you know, any accessory that requires 12 volt option, uh, you can plug right into there. His manual power pull switch is also installed there. Inside this front hatch, you can see the customer supplied us with his battery. It's something we do here. If they want to uh, send their components or or, or uh, items to us, we'll, we'll you know we'll take that and install it for them based on what they want. You can see we've got the gas shocks that hold up that front hatch. Um, again, another customer request. Uh, they don't have to go on there, but if you'd like them, we can do it. If you don't know, this is a 92-core uh, cooler that comes uh, installed in the boat. <laughs> it's part of the boat, so you don't have to lug those coolers and take them in, take them out, and scuff up the score. It comes right in the, right in the boat. Trailer, standard Ramblin' trailer. Uh, when I mean standard, uh, you can see it's a galvanized uh, trailer. That's a standard trailer. It comes uh, with a spare. Uh, and the neat thing is that it also comes with this nice Fulton jack, which is standard on all of our skiffs and this uh, nice wench cover, uh, another standard feature on this nice trailer. Raylan, you know, makes this trailer for this skiff, uh, and it's uh, balanced, it's great. It's, uh, I can't say enough about this trailer. It's probably the best on the market as far as we're concerned. That's why we use them. Uh, great trailer. Um, but uh, that's it, man. If you're, uh, if you're on the fence uh, with, uh, with a skiff, come check us out. Uh, check out the website, eastcapeskiffs.com. Uh, we got all kinds of interactive stuff on there to look at, videos, uh, forums, uh, just uh, anything, man. Check us out. Thank you.